everyone, thank you for coming back to my channel. I'm Stephanie, if you're new here. Today we are going to be making Mexican street corn. Um, we will be first putting the corn in the air fryer and then we will be mixing up our mix, put it on top of our corn. So I'm not sure if any of you guys already had Mexican street corn before. I have not tried it yet. So this is gonna be my first time and this is my first time um, putting the corn in the air fryer too. We're so used to just boiling them in a pot of water and eating it that way. So I'm kind of excited to try it out this way and see how it's gonna taste. So I kind of cheated a little bit, but I went to the store and just picked up some corn that was already um, cut up and done for me. So what you're gonna wanna do is just um, take all the skins and stuff off and then all the stuff in the inside, you're just gonna wanna take that all off of there. And then um, if you want to cut them down even smaller, you can do that. But these are pretty good size that I think I can get a couple of these in my air fryer with the size of mine. So that's what I'm gonna do. And what you're gonna need to do first is preheat your air fryer. Um, you're gonna wanna go to put it on 390 and you're gonna wanna preheat it for three minutes. I'm gonna let that preheat and then we'll be talking a little bit about the mix that we are gonna be putting on uh, our corn. So in front of me here, I have some mayo, I have sour cream, chili powder, um, some lime juice, and then um, some cortija cheese. If you guys are not familiar with this, it has a really odd like smell to this, um, and it tastes it tastes pretty good. It just is a little bit different, so I'm kind of interested into finding out how this is going to taste. If you guys have made Mexican street corn before, leave it down in the comments and let me know what you guys do different. I probably will be adding some salt and pepper to it. I'm not gonna put butter on the corn this time just because I am gonna be mixing up this mix after the corn is done. So my air fryer is preheated. I just got a couple little sprinklers here. All right, so you're just gonna wanna place these right in here. I'm just gonna take off what is left here. All right, so I'm able to get all of them in there. You're gonna wanna set your air fryer to 395. You're gonna cook it for 10 minutes, but we are gonna flip them at five minutes. While we wait for our corn to cook, we are gonna get started with the mix. My mayo in, or my sour cream in mayo in. Both of the um, mayo and sour cream are a half a cup. And then you're gonna do, I think it's a half a cup of the Gortija cheese. Chili powder. And lime. Just mix that up together. Like I said, I'm gonna add some salt and pepper. We're gonna finish up with the corn, let that cook. It has a couple more minutes before I need to flip it and then we'll come back flip and then we'll cook it for the rest of the time and we will top it with our topping. I think a little bit. There we go. And now we're gonna cook them for the rest of the five minutes. Right here. And I'm just gonna place them in my little baskets. Oh, I got an extra one in there. Just do that. So 
we are gonna tap. Now you can leave your corn like this if you would like and just eat it with butter and salt and pepper. Or if you have another seasoning that you wanna tap on here, like maybe seasoning salt or something like that. Um, let me know down in the comments below how you guys eat your corn. Um, usually we just tap it with butter, salt and pepper and that's about it. So I am going to put on, um, maybe not all of them, but maybe like, here, well, let's do this. Maybe like three of them, I'll put the um, the sauce on. So that's what I'll do. And just put that all on top. Oh, this has gotta be messy. So I don't know how you guys have eaten this. I should have put them little corn things on. I'm gonna add a little bit of salt and pepper to the top of mine. And then I'm gonna give one a try. I never really knew what it tasted like, but it is super yummy. All right, hopefully you guys liked today's video. Don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.